If I had no carers, I would literally be confined to bed. I can't remember when did I have a last break. I can't. Until it happens to you, you don't think that you'd be left without any safety net? Well, my heart sinks and I'm frightened of having another stroke because I get so concerned and feel as though they're dumping me, just leaving me to fend for myself. There's no organised way to find local carers. I was just told to put adverts in local shops as if you'd go to hospital and just be told to find your own doctor. I care for my younger sister who has got advanced stage of dementia. I used to enjoy reading. I used to love gardening. I'm not able to do that. What do I expect from my life now? That's gone. My career has gone. My whole life has gone. The cost of care is a huge burden to me. It leaves me very concerned about buying essentials, such as food. I was living in uh, my own property. That was sold. All the money was taken away from my care. With enough respite, i would be less anxious, and I think i will provide more care and support to my sister. If I got the care that I needed, can arrange the hours I want to cook my meals and have my meals, can go out and do the things I want to do and have kind of the life choices people my age have. For David, Priscilla, Edith, and for all of us who want good care, hashtag keep your promise, Boris. Fix social care right to your MP at www.keepyourpromiseboris.com.